A San Diego family created a new game to help people cope with the pandemic. It's called It's Contagious, and it allows players to work through their anxiety with a little bit of humor. Scripps reporter Jim Patton has more on the game of positivity. This is the game that our family came up with. And it's going to be so, so exciting. An exciting moment for the Pickett family of Fallbrook when the first production packs of playing cards arrived for a game they designed and called It's Contagious. Folks will find that the artwork on the cards is really relatable and also just like a fun take on this very challenging situation that we're all in. For the Picketts and their two children, the situation came very close to home in March when their grandfather tested positive for COVID. His case ended up becoming quite severe, um, putting him into the ICU. The family coped in part just by being together and playing games. But the stress of the pandemic and its very personal impact was never far off. We noticed our kids were processing things by adding like hand washing stations to their Lego builds. And so we were like, well, that's right. That's kind of how we do things as humans. We play through it. And we figure out how we're feeling. With that in mind, a project was launched. We found some old poker cards we had. Lola took a Sharpie and white out and started marking them up. And we're like, yeah, well, what if we had this card that did this? Virus cards, spreaders, and antibodies. The headlines and stories of 2020 becoming the cards of It's Contagious. Remember the cafe in Germany requiring patrons to wear pool noodle hats for social distancing? So we thought, well, there's a card. That's hilarious. And so we have things like that. We have home haircut. We have the um, TP shortage, which we're going through again. Yeah, like Zoom <laughs> birthday parties. And, and things like antibodies become superheroes. They become like a super power card in the deck, just like they do in real life. And the game itself becoming a part of real life as the Pickets have invested in real artwork and production in the hope that It's Contagious catches on. We found that play is one of the fastest ways to processing and moving through some of that trauma and that experience. Jim Patton, ABC 10 News.